out Center Point Energy could face stiff consequences here in Texas if they do not restore power soon. Governor Greg Abbott joining state leaders with a harsh warning for Houston's largest electric provider, accusing it of cutting corners before Hurricane Barrel. Seven days after the storm, more than 400,000 people, actually, let me rephrase that, as of today, over 200,000 people still do not have power. That's down from more than 2 million at the start of last week. Barrel knocked out more than 2,000 power lines and Centerpoint is deployed 14,000 linemen to restore the power and these linemen and crews are coming from all over the country. But the prolonged outages have really enraged Houstonians. State leaders promised investigations into Centerpoint's preparedness and threatened possible financial and regulatory consequences as well. Allegations have been made that while Texans have been baking in deadly heat without power, Center point was penny pinching and cutting corners in ways that slow the recovery process. Mm. Those allegations must be investigated. We must know was Center point protecting Texans or was it protecting its own pocketbook? I know everyone at Center point who's in an air conditioned office is watching. A freight train's coming. You just heard it. You better be prepared. Still, Centerpoint has restored power faster than in previous hurricanes. They project to restore 90% of impacted customers by today. At the same point after Hurricane Ike in 2008, only 53% of customers were restored in the first week.